This is Chicago's very own WGN Evening News at 5. New at 5, leaders of Messiah Lutheran Church in Joliet are praying for a miracle to keep the church doors open. Yeah, the pastor says they didn't do anything wrong, but they now have less than three months to pay the federal government hundreds of thousands of dollars. WGN's Jewel Hillary has the story. Hi, good evening. Messiah Lutheran Church has been around for more than 120 years, and now the church is calling on the community to help them raise $300,000 by November 15th. If the church doesn't get that money, they could be forced to close. Judy Jelm has attended Messiah Lutheran Church in Joliet for 30 years. It's my life and it's my love. The pastors here are wonderful. Judy, along with church leadership and other members at Messiah, are praying for a miracle to save their church. Our situation is a true David versus Goliath. It's a, it's a modern day battle. In 2019, the Securities and Exchange Commission filed a lawsuit against a local business claiming the business defrauded numerous investors. As part of that litigation, a receiver for the SEC was appointed to recoup money the business paid others. This included more than $780,000 in donations to Messiah over 10 years. Messiah's senior pastor, Kurt Hoover, says the money was spent on salaries, ministry, and daily operations. As a church, you don't have much of a reserve fund. You're really spending as much as you can every year on your ministry. Now the SEC receiver is demanding the church pay $300,000 by November 15th. If Messiah can't pay that amount, the federal government will raise the amount to $400,000, freeze the church's assets, and likely ask them to sell the building. Judy says she's got faith that a miracle will keep her beloved Messiah Lutheran Church alive. Oh, God's going to come through. He sent it to us in the first place. So far, Pastor Kurt says they've been able to raise about $30,000. If you're interested in making a donation, you can click on the story on our website at WGNTV.com. Reporting in Joliet, I'm Jewel Hillary, WGN News.